everyone, it's Grant. How's it going? I hope you're all enjoying the outdoors like I am this morning. No, really, I hope you're inside, like, in your pajamas, binge-watching some uh, Disney princess movies, sipping on sweet tea. Wait, you're not binge-watching princess movies? No? You're not, you're not binge-watching princess movies? That's what we're doing? No, that's not what I'm doing. But that's what the girls are doing. I hope you're enjoying your time alone at home. Um, separated from everybody else, but really with your family, enjoying some family time, working on some different things around the house. Uh, I really hope you're enjoying all of that. There's a car that's going to drive by in a second. It's going to get loud, so I'm going to stop talking for just a minute. And now the car's passed. Uh, so at this point, I'm like, I'm sure you're going, why in the world is Grant posting a video of himself sitting in his front yard out in the middle of nowhere with cars driving by and sending it to us? Well, um, that's a good question, and I know, like, others of you are going to be like, oh, I know why Grant's doing that. He has no one to talk to. Like, he's really bored, sitting at home, by himself. Well, that's not the case. Hey, guys. Uh, I have a question for you about uh, COVID-2019. Um, hey, why, why is everybody leaving? What about you, Alfred? What do you got to say about COVID-2019? Oh, jeez. Nothing? All right, fine. All right. All right. Somebody, here, please tell me you have something to say about COVID-29. Come, come on, why are you running away? Come on. Social distancing. Come on. Uh, chickens don't count, right? on it. But even if it is the case, I'm sending you this video because I have some really, really important stuff to talk to you guys about this morning. Uh, some really important things that I'd love for you guys to hear, for you to share with your parents, really for your parents to hear. Another car. Give me a minute. <laughs> a road that's always empty and all of a sudden all the cars drive by when you're recording a video. Uh, so, over the past handful of days I've spent a lot of time in thought and prayer talking with my team, um, Thomas, Pastor Thomas and Christy and Tracy and Burl. I want to tell you with a heavy heart I, made, I had to make some really difficult decisions uh, over the past couple of days. And so, at this point, um, because of the executive order, um, because of the current projections on how this virus is because of the current closings. Well, let me add, North Bay also uh, sent us something and told us that we wouldn't be able to have our retreat the weekend we wanted it. So I've had to make the decision to just call Revive um, just because of the current circumstance. And so I know inside you're like, oh. And as upset as we are, you know, sometimes it's difficult. We have to make these kind of decisions. But we're excited and we're looking forward to when this stuff breaks and we can get back together um, and, and back together in community when we can spend time and celebrate just us being back together. Um, and so for your parents, I know your parents are on the other side and they're going like, whoa, cancel revive. That was a lot of money. What do I do with the money? Don't worry, I got you covered. Um, I've been talking to our staff here at the church. Although the church office is closed, we're putting together some things in order to be able to get you guys your refunds. And so what I'd like you to do, um, parents, if, if you would like your refund or, or, or considering you're gonna want your refund, please send an email to nocorona at fcfchurch.com or you can send an email to revive refund at fcfchurch.com. Honestly, both both those emails actually work. I set them up. I just thought no corona was more fun. Um, you can send an email to one of those emails. Please provide us with your name uh, that was on the check, the amount of money that you had sent us, if you remember, and your address, your current actual address that you would like uh, your refund sent back to. And uh, we'll we'll be taking those emails. We'll be uh, processing them through our accountant, our, our bookkeeper, who's an amazing lady. Um, she's going to do her hardest to try to get you guys uh, your refunds as quick as she can. Um, and so uh, we'll be processing those. So by sending an email to one of those two, uh, that'll trigger us to start processing and, and sending back a refund. Please be patient with us because, again, the office is closed. There's no one in it. Um, everybody's working from home. Uh, that's the reason here you can see my office outside uh, in the lovely Detour, Maryland. And so please be patient with us as we try to return your money um, that you guys have sent in order to save your spot for Revive. Uh, I thank you so much for you guys' support in youth ministry. I look forward to seeing some of you on social media, to seeing some of you on the on the church streams. I look forward to seeing some emails from some of you so we can chit-chat a little bit um, about how you're doing and what's going on in your life right now. Um, and I look forward to hearing from all of you. Purple Alfred wanted to join the video. Thank you so much for your time. Uh, have an awesome uh, time off, distraction-free home time. Thanks. Watch out, here he comes. Oh my goodness, yard lion. Watch out, there he is.